More snow showers through the rest of the night, but we did not have much of that in January. Looking back to January 2020, we only measured 4.2 inches of snow for the official snowfall in Pittsburgh. That's 11.8 inches below normal just for the month of January, or rather we had 11, eight, let me start again, 4.2 inches of snow for the month of January. Our normal snowfall for January is 11.8. That's 7.6 inches below normal just for the month. Then we're looking at it being the lowest snowfall total for January since 1998 when we only measured 1.7 inches of snow. So the snow didn't fall in January. We have a little bit of it now in downtown Pittsburgh and already a half an inch to an inch on the ground in spots north of Pittsburgh. We're at 33 degrees. We only made it up to 34 for the afternoon high. Temperatures at or just below freezing from Pittsburgh to the north. And the warmest spot we see is Morgantown at 35, Waynesburg, Washington at 34. The bulk of the snow showers have already, the heaviest activity has pushed through pretty much across I-79. It is now pushing through portions of Jefferson, Indiana, Armstrong counties, and then becoming a little more scattered as you head down I-79. Downtown Pittsburgh, a little light flurry activity now back to the west toward the airport, more numerous, and then down into eastern portions of Washington County. A little bit of dry air too. And look on the back side of this, already still getting some change over to rain as warmer southwesterly breezes push that warm air in. So the next couple of hours, still a push of some last snow showers. By 5, 6 a.m. they're done. Then tomorrow, here's 7 a.m. on Futurecast, the last of these move out. We're left with just overcast skies, a big surge of southwesterly warm air changes it over to rain by tomorrow night north of I-80. But the rest of us stay dry. Monday, a pretty nice day. We'll actually get some breaks in the cloud cover and have partly cloudy skies. Temperatures in the 50s, if you can believe that, for early February. And then overnight, Monday into Tuesday, here comes the next push of moisture. But by that time, with temperatures in the 50s, it will be rain. So tonight, scattered snow showers mixing with a touch of rain toward the end. The low only 31. Tomorrow, it's Punxsutawney Phil's big day, Groundhog Day. And we're looking at highs by the end of the day into the mid 40s. So what falls tonight? An inch or two along and north of I-80. And in the Laurel Highlands, it'll melt. Then we're looking at 50s Monday, Tuesday, back to the 40s toward the end of the week, Paul.